Alright, this is again your buddy Blogsmith Jim with another stock prediction. We're going Bitcoin, Bitcoin stocks, and altcoins. And I'm going to try to give you the nuggets of information as quickly and efficiently as possible. So, try not to be too long-winded. So anyway, Bitcoin, BTC, down 12% for the day. But... Within the last hour, it went up about 7%, and it's still climbing. So the lowest it was was 10205 but now, last I checked, it was $11,854. $11,854. So that's $1,600 in a very short amount of time that it made up. But uh, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, Litecoin, which I have. I have one coin. Ripple. Uh, they they all followed the path of Bitcoin, so I don't know chicken or the egg, but they all went down at once. Uh, so, in my opinion, prediction or advice: if you have faith in Bitcoin and, and alternative currencies, uh, all of them actually, I would say the time is now to buy because it's, they're bouncing back already, and I think uh, you know they're not ready to fall. So, I think they'll get back. They could get back to that 20,000. They could go higher. It just amount, depends on who gets back on the bandwagon. Because if it's the same riders, then, uh, then we'll probably see the same thing. But if we get somebody else that is coming out of the woodwork and is jumping on the Bitcoin bandwagon while it's going up, it's probably going to go up some more. So, and that goes for Ethereum, Litecoin, and then Ripple. Ripple is apparently the, the best one of them all because uh, the technology behind it is a little more sound and, and less likely to be hacked. But one thing I do want to address, the, the Asia news that was coming out and talking about all these um, countries that are trying to discourage the use of Bitcoin and maybe ban ICOs and all that stuff, this is a smokescreen. That's, I mean, I'm not over there, so I'm not talking to people over there, but just judging from history and seeing how how things behave and how the stock market has behaved I would say this is a smokescreen manipulation you know because um, the Asian market is so far from us that they can say stuff and then if we buy into it it could be hype or it could be truth but people are gonna people are gonna jump on that a lot of times so you have to fight that urge and be contrarian so you have to look at it as smokescreen and not believe it Kind of like the whole Jeff Sessions saying he's going to prosecute recreational marijuana. Not going to happen. He's not going to do it. That's my Dana Carvey impersonating uh, George Bush Sr. Anyway. So, as far as the stocks go, my grand slam of Bitcoin stocks. You got BITCF. Not recommended. I used to like them, but uh, because they're not... They're not uh, forthcoming with a lot of information and they had some trouble with the SEC just wait they could come back they could be very good but right now I'm not recommending it until it starts reversing upwards BTSC that's another company that I actually kinda like um, I think they're just gonna go up when Bitcoin starts going up so if you like Bitcoin stocks uh, they don't behave exactly like the cryptocurrencies but they follow them so people kinda go back and forth trade Selling the, selling the coins, then buy the stock, and then go back and forth. So just keep that in mind. Um, so I think it's going to go up. GBTC is really closely held, tied to, to Bitcoin. So as Bitcoin goes up, GBTC goes up. And it's a huge, huge price, but you'll see that there are some huge gains in it. So um, like I said, I think that will go up more closely. BTCS, uh, Progressive Philosophy. Sorry to take so long to drop your name, but uh, you asked for, for this video for BTCS to be addressed, so I uh, wanted to give you props and thank you for, for the comments. And remember again, comment, like, share, and subscribe on my whole channel. Um, so BTCS has supposedly has a merger in the works, but there's nothing, nothing concrete as far as I've seen. Um, you could take a small flyer on it because I think it does have potential to go pretty high. I would say no more than five percent though of your uh, 
of your portfolio. And I think just wait and see kind of approach. Um, but but five percent investment is can pay off. I mean, you could put in a thousand dollars and and get you know five grand out of it. So, uh, but the last of the stocks, uh, Sing S I N G, I will uh, give you in the next video because I'm trying to shorten these. So. This is Blogsmith Jim telling you to keep on living in abundance. Stay tuned for part two with Sing. And comment, like, share, and subscribe.